How old are they? We're about. We got them a couple weeks they ago. They weren't six. They, they weren't six when we got them. They were definitely. They said they were six, but they were. Like leave the area that you washed, but then they go to their head because you didn't get the shampoo along their head. Yeah. Obviously, because if they were still having any problems, that's forty dollars. Okay. Um, but you can do the vaccines without the exam if okay. you want to. Is it? It's been so difficult for the pet owners and for people that work at shelters because we want to see animals stay with their loving homes. So many of these are people who have been dedicated to their animals throughout their lives and now they've lost their jobs. So they're trying to find creative ways to take care of their families that include their animals. And so what we're trying to do with um, partnerships like this is make services available wherever we can to keep the families together. Perfect for a yard. Yeah, what, well, huh? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Hey, what a beautiful dog. How are you? How are you? We've heard stories of people just leaving their, you know, especially cats, leaving their cats out in the middle of the streets or, you know, some parking lot, you know, basically because they can't take care of them. Uh, and, it's, and it's all because of the economy. The economy's hitting everybody. And, uh, you know, assistance like this, you know, people should take advantage of it. Okay. You know, it's, you know, why make, why make a pet suffer? You know, and there's organizations like this that'll help us out. So. Do you know where he came from? Do you know where he came from? Yeah. Um, it seems like he came from the Furby's a beautiful cat that can be a little shy at first. Uh, yeah, I think it's affecting a lot of pet owners because um, they can't afford to buy the things their pets need. They're losing their houses and having to move into apartments that don't necessarily allow pets. And a lot of times pets just get left by the wayside and the general turmoil that's going on in a lot of people's lives. So I certainly think it's a difficult time for people to hold on to their pets. There's actually a brand called Marijuana Cigarettes. It's like catnip? Yeah. Is this so here? I'm going to put you in here where you can't cause any trouble. What do you think of that? <laughs> and one for you. We just brought back a uh, bag of cat food and some litter from the ASPCA because they were giving free um, donations towards pet owners for those that can't really help afford their own pets. And it's actually pretty helpful for us because we have a hard time taking care of our pets as is with the economy going on. Let's make you see. Is there another one? Ow. No, there's like a, a feral hand. cat that likes oh. to like run around. How's he been living? 